All right, guys, here we are. Filming, yep, all right. We're about to start getting after these spring beaver here. Finally got some open water here. Sorry, I'm kind of out of breath. It's interesting getting down to this. I mean, you can see right here, the beavers are already working this bank. You can see they got it all slicked up. So I'm gonna try and get my caster now to go right in here. You guys, yep, you can see that, okay. So I got here's a, this one's about an eight foot rebar drowner. I'm gonna get it right in here. That water's chilly. I forgot my gloves. If I can get this stake in the ground here. i pull up my sleeves. Take our TS-85 here. Make this look all good. Make ourselves a nice solid bed here. There's TS-85 to sit on. Water's chilly. Set it right like that. If you guys can see this here, I got it about four inches underneath the water. I'm gonna slick up the bank a little bit. Make it looks like it's been worked. Need to find a stick for my caster. This work, maybe? No. Uh, that'll work. I can get to it without dying. There we go. Reach in my pocket here. This is what I use for all my caster mounds, guys. Dunlaps, big pile kind of just what I started using and it works so if it ain't broke don't fix it get this broken off here get some caster on there shove it in the bank like so now when this beaver comes up here he's gonna swim up up into the current he's gonna put his nose right on this stick and when he does that he's gonna drop his feet when he drops his feet, hopefully they're right on that trap. And hopefully we'll have one here tomorrow. So we got a lot more stuff to set today. We're gonna try and get about half our line out, 30, 30 drowners today. We'll see what happens. So on to the next one. Well, we're at another one here. I'm gonna try and get this right in here somewhere. All rock? No. Okay. Get my drowner in the mud out here. If I can find somewhere that's not concrete. No. I want to deep. No. I'm gonna have to start over. There maybe. Rock. There we go. That'll do it. Get our stake in the top there. Now I'm just gonna pull some of this away. Like so. Kind of a little something weird going on up in here but we're gonna throw some caster up in here see what happens basically already got a bed for me sitting there so that worked out get our trap set Get our caster. There we go. 
see what happens with that one in the morning. It's not ideal, but it should work. But anyways, this creek, you can see it's it's a pretty deep creek for how narrow it is, but that's because there's a dam down there. So we'll see what happens with this one tomorrow. On to the next one. All right, we got an interesting situation here. The camera, oh, I gotta get my shot out of here. But there's beaver tracks going up into this, this hole right here. I don't know if they're trying to make a bank den or what, but I'm gonna make somewhat of a Hail Mary set, I guess you could call it. If I can find somewhere to get my drowner into the bottom at. It's not sandy as heck. Right there, maybe. We can try that. I'm just gonna try and, since they're already coming up here, I don't even know if I'd need to put caster here, but I'm gonna try and get the trap right up in there. Oh, my sleeves up. Something like that, maybe. I don't know I'm interested to see what this one's gonna do this is kind of a weird deal there we go. There. so the reason I'm setting this one is if you can see down there there's an old dam that's broken they haven't fixed it yet, but they've definitely been working on it. There's some fresh mud on it. And these tracks in the dirt here, these are fresh. They, they ain't been too old. It's been cold and everything's been frozen. So I'd say within the last week or so, something's went up in there. So we'll see what happens. Now it's time to try and make it out of this sucker. So I'll see you guys at the next one. All right, so we're down in another one here. If you guys can see some beaver tracks there i don't know what that digging is i don't know if that's the beavers or not but some tracks over there too so we're gonna i might make an actual caster mound on this one just because the bank's not very steep get a bed here for our tribe Throw some mud up on the bank. Slick this up. Right. I don't know if you guys can pick that up underneath the water or not, but that's what it looks like underwater. About three and a half, four inches underwater there. Get me a stick for my caster. There we go. There's one. I'm actually gonna put two in down here. There's a ton of sign Around here, a bunch of chews treed on and stuff. Trees chewed on, my bad. I don't know how to talk. But yeah, I'm gonna throw another one in here and be moving on. <laughs> 